For people in southern Putnam County, loud noises in the sky this past weekend. <laughs> Multiple reports from North St. Louis County residents of a strange noise. Yeah, the source of that noise is still unclear, and they brought their complaints to Contact 2's Mike Colombo. In various parts of the world, there have been cases of a nearly inaudible but remarkably consistent low humming noise. This past weekend also, something louder and more unsettling occurred. People heard strange loud noises, an otherworldly sound emanating from beyond the sky. This eerie, booming echo seems to descend from the heavens themselves. Everywhere you turn, you hear reports of this mysterious happening all around the globe. People everywhere, regardless of creed or culture, gaze skywards, their hearts racing as fear permeates the air. This isn't the opening scene of a science fiction movie. It's our reality in 2024. So what if I told you there's more to these sounds? Yes, but first, what are these sounds and where do they originate? Could they be long foretold signs echoing across time? Brethren, let's find out together in today's video. Already this year has etched itself into history not only for its advancements and crises, but also for something perplexing, inexplicable sonic occurrences that grip the world with awe and anxiety. From the most significant landscapes to the tiniest crannies, a global sensation has seized the attention of the world, causing hearts to flutter and minds to spin with curiosity. It's as though the celestial dome has split open, releasing sounds so deep and alien that they baffle any rational interpretation. These are not the usual sounds of our existence. The hum of vehicles, the chatter of people, the rustle of the breeze. No, these are sounds from another realm, resonating with a sense of urgency that demands attention. The descriptions attributed to these sounds range from metallic moans and heavenly harmonies to skyward trumpets. In Canada, a family records a video of eerie melodies carried on the breeze, a concert of unknown origin that leaves them gazing upwards in wonder and apprehension. Similar occurrences have occurred in Mexico City, where thousands are captivated by celestial-like sounds. These unique experiences have formed a global concern, suggesting a message prophesied in Revelation 14 verse 2, as it seems we are at the brink of the apocalypse. Ancient texts and the heart of the Bible contain clues that have fascinated and warned humanity for centuries. It says, there will be signs in the sun, moon, and stars. On the earth, nations will be in anguish and perplexity at the roaring and tossing of the sea. People will faint from terror, apprehensive of what is coming upon the world, for the heavenly bodies will be shaken. Luke 21 verses 25 to 26. These words resonate through the ages, urging us to pay attention, to recognize that these sounds hold more profound significance beyond scientific curiosity. This passage invites us to consider whether the sounds we hear are the trumpets of revelation, heralding the end times, or merely reminders prompting reflection. Brethren, we've seen how the entertainment industry, along with other media, has subtly shaped our values in negative ways. Songs glorifying violence, demeaning women, and exalting materialism, along with depictions of casual sex and self-indulgence, are becoming the order of the day. The fashion industry too, with its provocative imagery and unrealistic beauty ideals, suggests our worth is tied to our physical appearance. These trends erode our faith, leading us to question religious teachings and absolute truth. However, we can resist these trends, hold fast to our faith, and regain our moral direction. It starts with awareness of how sin is normalized and faith is undermined. We must protect our hearts and minds, view everything through God's word, and seek positive influences. In our quest for understanding, we draw inspiration from Daniel 2 verse 22. He reveals deep and hidden things. He knows what lies in darkness, and light dwells with him. These words offer comfort and encouragement, reminding us of a greater wisdom at work. As we witness the sounds from the sky in our own time, we approach this phenomenon as an opportunity for reflection, wonder, 
and a deepened sense of connection to the past, each other, and the mysteries of the universe. The mysterious sounds from the sky challenge us to expand our understanding and bridge the gap between science and spirituality. As these phenomena continue to captivate people worldwide, the scientific community diligently seeks answers and explores realms of natural phenomena and technological wonders. Meteorologists and geophysicists suggest these sounds could result from atmospheric acoustics, such as abrupt temperature gradients. Geological explanations like tectonic movements are also considered. Technological sources such as experimental aircraft or large-scale engineering projects present another avenue of exploration. Acoustic experts introduce the concept of infrasound, which sounds at frequencies too low to be heard by the human ear, but is capable of traveling long distances. The search for answers also considers psychological and sociological factors in perceiving and interpreting these sounds. This journey of exploration and understanding reminds us of our boundless capacity for awe and the enduring human quest for knowledge. The public's diverse reactions to these sounds, ranging from skepticism to acceptance, paint a vivid picture of a world grappling with unexplainable phenomena. In the digital age, news of these sounds and their possible explanations spread rapidly, sparking widespread discussion. Skeptics question the scientific community's conclusions, pointing to historical precedents of unexplained phenomena that were eventually understood. Conversely, others embrace the scientific explanations, finding solace in the possibility of understanding the unknown. This phenomenon draws us to the pages of ancient scripture, where the echoes of prophecy resonate with an exhilarating and profoundly sobering timeliness. At the heart of this divine mystery are the trumpets of the Book of Revelation, a cornerstone of biblical prophecy that has fascinated scholars, theologians, and believers for centuries. The Apostle John's vivid account of his visions on the island of Patmos speaks of seven trumpets that herald the end of days, each trumpet blast unleashing events of cosmic significance upon the earth and its inhabitants. The description of the seventh trumpet in Revelation 11 verse 15 resonates with a sense of urgency that mirrors our times, proclaiming the final victory of the divine over the temporal. These scriptural references offer a lens through which we can interpret contemporary events, imbuing them with a depth of meaning that transcends the immediate and tangible. When viewed through this lens, the sounds from the sky become more than a curiosity. They become a call to awareness, a prompt to reflection. Historical precedents for such celestial signs abound, with instances recorded throughout the Bible where God used natural phenomena to communicate with his people. This underscores the power of the unseen in shaping human destiny. In our quest to understand the mysterious sounds of today, we are drawn into a dialogue with the past, with the prophetic traditions that have guided humanity's spiritual journey for thousands of years. The enigmatic sounds from the sky draw us towards a contemplative horizon, standing at the intersection of history and prophecy. It's hard not to consider the spiritual implications of these phenomena. Could these celestial symphonies be the trumpets of revelation? The precursors of the end times foretold in ancient scripture. The Book of Revelation, with its vivid imagery and profound symbolism, offers a panoramic view of the culmination of history. The sound of trumpets signifies pivotal moments in the unfolding divine drama, serving as a call to humanity and a reminder of God's sovereign will over creation. Theological analysis points not to fear-mongering, but to an awakened awareness of the spiritual dimension of existence. It invites us to consider the possibility that these sounds are not merely anomalies to be explained away by science, but are instead signs calling us to spiritual readiness. Historical instances of divine communication through natural phenomena provide a precedent for interpreting the current sounds as messages with spiritual significance. The sounds from the sky challenge us to expand our spiritual perception, stirring a sense of wonder and humility in us. They confront us with the vastness of the unknown and the certainty of the divine. This theological reflection encourages us to view these phenomena through the lens of faith, considering their role in the larger narrative of salvation history and the eschatological hope that defines Christian belief. As we grapple with the theological implications of these sounds, let us do so with a spirit of humility and openness, recognizing the limits of our understanding and the boundlessness of divine wisdom. These phenomena should not drive us to fear but to a renewed commitment to live according to the values of the kingdom of God, embodying love, justice, and mercy in a world yearning for redemption.